Hello everyone, welcome back to Hobby Master. And today we are going to be doing another video on training any dog. Huh, Madison? These are ways, mostly games, like with toys, to keep your dog busy if you can't directly tend to it. So interactive stuff. Starring Madison! Hi! Ow! Okay, first off, there's just a toy. So, these toys are called Burrow Toys. They have, it's this one is a banana with little monkeys inside, and the dog has to put their nose through the holes to get them out. She has yet to figure that out, but she does have a fun time with it. Good bow! What the heck? And one, one night she was playing with it, and she was whipping it around, and I just saw monkeys flying. Thankfully one didn't hit a picture frame or anything. They were flying at like 3,000 miles an hour. Next, if you have a little bin, seriously, take a squeaky toy or any sound your dog likes, and... That's Madison's signature move. Last night, she took it. She took the bin and tried to go in her crate with it. It was so funny. Watch this. Ow! She just bit my thumb. Dude, it's right here. You, you put that. Don't bite that. No, Madison. Yeah, that's what you're supposed to bite. Crazy. Stop. Seriously? Here is... And they're actually not all interactive games because I want to show you guys some cool things you can do. So, here is how you get them to, you train them to do up. Yeah. As you can see, Madison's a pro. So, like, put this in slow motion or something. Good up! I have white fuzz in my hair. And then, of course, there's, whoa, the signature game of fetch. Just find a toy they really, they really like, throw it, and get over here. <laughs> yeah, I'll have an entire video on training fetch at some point. Madison, <laughs> good tug. Watch this. Ow, though. And then there's so if you have an old towel lying around that you don't mind getting scratched up, you can grab again a toy with a squeaker. No, 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 no. Wait. Ready? Oh, Madison knows this game. Stop! 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 No! 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 Not yet. Wait. Ready? Go. And most dogs, especially dogs that were trained to hunt, like, small animals will like this because it's digging for their prey. Those types of dogs are really good at that. And anyway, all dogs have a prey instinct. She'll keep going at it even if there's nothing in it. And if you do this with your dog, never put your hand under it and wiggle it around because they won't realize it's your hand and then they'll go after it. Let's just say I got a nice cut on my finger from doing that. Sometimes when Madison actually gets to the toy, she doesn't even care. And and so she Whoa. So she she just keeps digging because she wants to dig. She doesn't really want to get the toy. This is how you train a dog to take toys out of the toy bin, stop Madison, wait, and put them back in. Well, this is just a game to take it out of to show them how they can get their toys from the toy bin. I'll show you how to train, put them back eventually. Just make sure the toy bin isn't so high that the dog chokes himself trying to reach in because that's what happens to Madison all the time. Well, you guys, there will be probably part two of this video. It's going to be pretty short because I want to do a video on how to train um, 
how to train fetch. So, say goodbye to Madison for now. And we'll see you in the next one, guys.